Hey, this is Slay with the one hour game challenge. So basically, I'm going to create a game and I only have one hour to do it. Which is not easy. So it's going to be a very simple game. Um, I didn't get to <laughs> spend a lot of time putting stuff together, but um, I think it's pretty good for, you know, what it is. I actually made this using RPG Playground. That's where the challenge came from. One of the mods, Comprehensible, came up with this challenge and I thought, that is so cool. Um, I'm gonna record myself doing this and maybe get some cloud out there for RPG Playground. It's a really cool site. It's free, I've been a member for over five years and it's just, it's such a cool place to learn how to make RPG games and it's really fun to share and play with other people. There are so many users and so many games, you guys. doing the woods and obviously this is not real time I had to speed it up by like 800 so my idea for this um, one hour fairy tale challenge is basically just this girl who's going to become a fairy by completing one good deed in a village. And I wanted to kind of show some range. So there's a mine, there's that little wood piece right there, there's the outside of the fairy village, and there's a small little village that you go to. Only got a couple houses in there, and I ran out of time at the end to complete the inside of um, any house, really. It's the only thing you can walk into, but... Shout out to DeWitters for creating the site. He's seriously awesome. He takes suggestions from people. He works on this. And like I said, he released it for free and it's been free for some years.
you guys liked this video, um, please go ahead, like, and subscribe. I plan on doing many more in the future. Um, just tell me kind of what you want to see, but until then, I'm just going to be posting random builds, I suppose. Probably more challenges or like little tutorials. It's not necessarily tutorials, but just showing you how I go about building and choosing characters and storylines and whatnot. Maybe a little screenplay stuff here and there. So at this point, I only had two minutes left, so I really was pushing it. I probably shouldn't have started a house interior, <laughs> but I really wanted to try to get in an interactive element that way. So this is how it ended up turning out. This is a playthrough. so easy to create games. There's a little bit of a learning curve, not too bad once you understand how the screenplays work, but you can make some pretty awesome stuff. If I did this in an hour, just imagine what you can make with a couple days. Finish the task, go back and talk to the fairies. They're like, oh hey, congrats, you can become one of us now. And character changes to the little fairy, and that's the end. game challenge complete i hope you enjoyed definitely check out rpgplayground.com it's amazing